Um, not quite sure if I'm going to use those. Just like I'm not sure. Don't put your booty in the camera. Oh my God, that is so rude. Don't put it in my face. <laughs> come, come here, come here, come here. You want to sit on mommy's lap? He's like, no. Okay. Hi, lovies. It is your girl, Veronica. We are back with another video and we're just going to jump right into it. If you can't tell by the title, we are doing a first year vet school haul. I have a list here that I'm going to be going over and I'm just so excited. So like I said, jump right into it. Our first item that I got on the list and some of these items are gifted. Some of these are bought. Um, things that I bought, I can like link down below, but um, things that I've been gifted I, I guess I could still link them down below. I didn't buy them though, but whatever. Um, this one I bought. This is a book bag. This is an essential, isn't it? I have little pins on the front because Naruto, love him. Um, ball pythons. I want to be an exotic vet, so obviously need to keep that in there for a little bit of a reminder of why I'm doing this because burnout is real. Um, but I have this nice sturdy book bag. It actually has a laptop in it right now, but um, it's my old laptop and this is actually a charging point, a port, a charging port. I just got this on Amazon, but like I said, I'll have everything linked down below. I was looking more of like quality of the bag over like looks of it. I still think it's cute. Um, there's a fly. I just saw a fly. Anyways, I still think it's cute, especially when like I'll get more pins on here because I do like pins on my book bags to like decorate it. Um, and it has plenty of room inside of it, like all multiple pockets, a pocket here, a pocket, a small pocket here, another pocket and a larger pocket, like for a strap and stuff for your thing. And this is the charging cord. It's super cute. Um, but yeah, just a bag. That's all it is. Next on our list, which this, none of these are like an essential, by the way. These aren't things that like, oh, you need to get them to the Um... You don't have to get any of this for vet school, to be honest. You really don't. This, these are just things that I wanted to have. Um, and in the list of things I wanted to have, I have this. This is a feature kit. Um, it comes with a silicone pad. Sir, I have it spelled like that. Maybe I just don't know. I don't. Mm, it says circical, circical, circical scissors. Surgical scissors? Surgical? Surgical? I don't know. I, I haven't been through vet school yet, clearly. So if, if it's surgical or surgical, I'm butchering it. Scissors. There's scissors. There's mosquito forceps. There's needle holder, Adson forceps, and scalpel handle. And it does come with um, templates in here. So you do have to be very careful. Um, and it comes with a lot of different kinds of I'm blanking suture. Comes with a lot of different suture. I actually got this as a gift um, Christmas of 2020. So I could try and find it. I'm pretty sure he got it off of Amazon, but it's been really handy. Anyways, moving on. Um, next on my list, I also got for the Christmas of 2020, and that is my stethoscope. She is gorgeous. She is a, oh my God, what is she? She's a cardio. A Littman Cardio 4. Um, when I first started my job, I was using one of the vets, like old classic Littman 3. Littman Classic 3. I don't know why I just can't get that right. But um, my boyfriend, he was my boyfriend at the time. He's my husband now. But my boyfriend, who's now my husband, um, he got me this. So it has a much thicker tube than the classic. I thought this is how I personally felt when I used both of them in such a close time frame together when I was able to compare. It feels like the tubing on this is like shorter than on the classic three. I, I noticed I was able to get around the animals more. Like I was able to just like, like get around them. But oh no. Oh, perfect. But I also noticed that with this one, I was able to hear like very, very well. Like sometimes I would be like oh is that a murmur and she'd be like no I'd be like are you sure and she's like hmm let me see and then I'll give her this because she had a class and then she'd be like huh yeah very slight grade one and I'd be like oh okay cool so you know we were able to like monitor it and look for any like progressions in that so that's what they tell you you know like you have thicker tubing so you can like hear more I'm not a stethoscope sponsored person I don't know I, I the the tubing is thicker and it lets more 
sounding. Like I said, I don't, I just, I don't work here. Moving on. Love it. Oh, I forgot. It has like a blue attachment to the bell. And on the inside here, it's really hard to see because of like the kind of font that it's in, but that's my name. Really cute. And my mom got me this little sea turtle stethoscope charm for Christmas last year, 2021. So cute. Now, <laughs> moving on. Those were the really fun things. Everything else is kind of like, eh. Um, we're going to go to writing utensils. Ooh, doo, doo, doo. Where? Oh, pens. I have a couple pencils. I didn't buy any pencils. I just have a couple like laying around. So I was like, let me just get a bunch of pens because I really like writing with pens. I love like the flow and everything. And just some basic black pens. I got dry erase markers. I got a big pack that's very colorful of the big thick chisel tips. And I have a small pack that are the same colors that are small little chisel tips. Um, super excited about that. With those dry erase markers, obviously comes a dry erase board. A dry erase board. A dry erase board. My board. I can't talk today. This, that's what this is. It's huge. I'm not going to lift her up because she's a little heavy. This is a, a three by four. I got it at Lowe's. So, I'll give y'all a little tippy tip here. Do not buy your whiteboards at Amazon. Just don't. Don't do it. I would not recommend it. Um, my sister actually gave me a whiteboard. It broke on my move up to Athens, Georgia. So yeah, unfortunately, I threw it away because it broke and it was really annoying to try and fix it. I was like, ooh, like it had a border and everything. As you can tell, this one doesn't have a border. Um, that's because it was $15. I want you to go look on Amazon and look up a three by four whiteboard and tell me how much it is. It's going to be like 60 plus dollars some of them like ridiculously priced at like a hundred and I was like ew so then I just googled whiteboard and I wanted a really big one and Lowe's popped up and I got that for 15 dollars so you know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go back I'm gonna get another one I'm gonna put them side by side then I have a huge whiteboard for like drawing anatomical figures or whatever else I want to draw with all my colorful expo markers and a bonus for moms um just get one of the tiny packs and get a $15 board for your child. This is like, this was like eight bucks. And then you have like a $25, you know, three hour long thing for your kid to do. I mean, my child loves it. So he's getting his own board soon too. But moving on. Um, I did the whiteboard. Okay. So this is my ID clip. Um, I'm not sure I'm going to use this in my first two years of vet school. It was just too cute when I saw it to like not even like not buy it so this is actually like a chickadee i love birds i love birding um i just recently got into it maybe like a year ago i'll say a year ago i don't know maybe a little bit longer but not really really into it until a year ago like books binoculars everything it, i think it's such like a great hobby um if you like pokemon i think you'll like birding it's like it's like real life pokemon that's not why i like it but i mean that's just how i kind of like get people to understand what it is but anyways um super cute it is a little thick but it's not like heavy so it is like really light and I do have another like more basic ID clip so I'll be um showing that to you guys later not in this video you'll probably just see it in my like vet school vlogs but um yeah that one's not with me at the moment but this one's super cute so I'm gonna link it down below I just love like creative people like there's not a lot of like bird ID badges and there was another one like this it was like pink and blue and this one's like yellow and blue it was just I just loved the colors of it gorgeous so moving on we got some of your basic items like a calculator um yeah this one's just like Casio this is gonna be for um I don't really know what I don't really know that I we've had this this is just part of my like stuff that I'm using for vet school my vet school hall um I'm assuming I'm going to use this for like fluid rate and stuff, but I don't know if we do that in vet school unless we're maybe in like clinicals. I'm sure I'll need a calculator in some of my classes. Like physiology, does that need a calculator? We don't know. We're going to find out. Maybe in like a year or maybe not even a year. Maybe after my first semester, I'll kind of like let y'all know like was any of this stuff useful? Like did I actually like use any of it, you know? I'll do it after a year. That would make sense because I got different classes in the spring. Whatever. Um, a stapler. Even though I don't plan on having a lot of papers, um, I want to keep everything as electronic as possible. 
Um, and that's going to bring us to our next thing is why did I buy so many notebooks? I don't know. I bought a bunch of notebooks. They're just so cute. Which way does it go? This one is so cute. It's like a suede notebook. Guess where I got it? Target, you got it. Um, notes and plans, just simple little things like that. This one was too cute. It's called Catitude is Everything. Thank you. I really like cats. This is more cats. This is actually really good. It says, what greater gift than the love of a cat? This was, I think these were all Target. I Oh, wait, no. Actually, I think these two. No, this was Target. And this was Michael's or Hobby Lobby. But like I said, everything's going to be linked down below. Um, none of them. A lot of them were like on sale. This one I got for like four bucks. I was like, oh. I can't pass that up. I got my sister a matching one because it was just so cute. Um, I just got this notebook yesterday. Ah, too cute. It's wide rule. I'm not sure what I'm going to use any of these notebooks for if I even use them for anything, but this was Walmart. It was, it was on sale. I had to get it. I couldn't say no. Oh my God. I'm like totally off track. Where am I? So um, next on the list for a vet school haul is going to be this beautiful thing right here I have it in a case this is my iPad I think it's hmm, it's just a regular iPad it's not an air it's not a pro um, it is maybe it's either the sixth seventh or eighth generation I know the ninth one is the newest I don't have the newest one this is the sixth seventh or eighth oh my god what, what happened to my case whatever so I have this pink case on it and this case you know it can fold and hold it up whatever we don't care about that right now we care about this so it comes with an apple pencil holder so i did get the apple pencil um this and this were gifted to me by my now husband <laughs> um yeah so it's really cool on this so it sounds kind of weird i you probably oh, kind of see it in the film so i have a like paper like cover on here so that when i write it's like i'm writing on paper and I can probably do another video on like my iPad and my MacBook. But right now I just kind of wanted to show that I did get an iPad and I did get the Apple Pencil. It's not a knockoff. Um, I had no idea who was going to get me this. I really wasn't expecting this because I just I kind of was expecting the iPad, but not this. Um, yeah, very thankful for it. Um, but I do know that there is like a really good like pen dupe on Amazon. So if this thing ever like fails on me, then I can always just get like that like $30 dupe instead of paying $100 for the pen. <laughs> now by any means, I don't want y'all to think I got money by making this video. I'm broke. Um, and I'm gonna be broke for four years. But still, let's um, just move on. I don't know why I put this up. My list is on this actually. So let's just bring that back up. <laughs> Okay, cool. So I bet. Um, I also have a MacBook that's actually downstairs right now. I think I may have shown it in a previous video, but if I do another video with my MacBook and my um my iPad talking about like how I have them set up for vet school, what I plan on doing with my notes, or how I organize my notes during vet school, you'll see them during those videos. But I have an Apple a Mac Air. It's the Mac Air 13 inch M1 processor. I know that's like, wow, that's so detailed for acting like you don't know what you have. Well, you have to kind of like know what you have when you like buy the case for the MacBook, if that makes sense. So I bought a case for it on Etsy and they're like, is it that, is it the Air 13 M1 or is it just the Air 13? I'm like, so I had to look it up. It's in your MacBook, so I had to look it up. So it's the Mac Air 13 inch M1 in rose gold. I was actually gifted it to me. I was actually, what in the world? It was gifted to me. Um, by my veterinarian at the clinic I worked for. Um, she was awesome. Loved her so much. It was such a surprise. I thought that actually her and Jared like got together and got me uh, the iPad. Um, that's why I thought she was getting me. Um, I actually didn't know I was getting a gift at all. But when she's like, I have a gift for you. I was like, oh, I bet her and Jared got an iPad. No, it was a whole MacBook Air. I was like, oh, it blew my mind. So God bless her. Love her to death. Um, you know, we always joke that in the future that I can be her relief, but 
I'm not joking. I would legit do it. Working on a mobile vet is one of the best things that ever happened to me. And I would highly recommend it if you have the opportunity to do it. But that's not the point of this video. Um, if y'all want a video about working on a mobile vet, like the pros, cons, things like that, I can definitely do one. So you can just comment below. But let's move on with this video. So obviously with more notebooks, I have a planner. I don't know if I'm going to use this, just like the other notebooks. But um, it is, this was Target. Comes with cute little stickers. I can't even see that. It's so like glary. Whatever, moving on. Um, it has just like the month. And then there are like days. So I love the days. This is where I got it actually. I think Target still has these up. So if you can see, whatever. Today's schedule to do and has checklists for each of the days. So it's just really like organized, cute and sweet to the point. I do have an hourly planner template if, oh, 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 hello, come here, come here, come here, you want to be in the video? Say hi. Oh, oh. I guess since Delta's done with us talking about the planner, we'll just move on to the binder. I just got a simple little binder. Oh, it's a second. I just got a simple little binder from who knows where, who knows. I think I got it from Target when I was out shopping with my bestie. Okay, <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to use them. I don't know if I'm going to use any of the planners, but we'll see. Um, now we're just getting to kind of like the little miscellaneous parts. There are a few things I haven't got for vet school that haven't like come in yet. So I don't know how I'm really going to, you know, put that in the video. Oh, here's a little miscellaneous. I have stickers. They're just so cute and colorful. Um, I probably should have got like individuals of the colors because like what if I want to use blue one day and then yellow the next day. And okay. All right. Okay. Say bye to Delta. I got us booing in the camera. Bye, Delta. Um, yeah, I probably just should have got different colors, but it is what it is. I have some gloves because I'm pretty sure we're going to need these for anatomy lab. And if not, um, I have reptiles, so these will be helpful for me anyways. But I got these for anatomy lab just because I got big hands, so I just got large. I know they'll have large, but I just kind of wanted my own gloves, so there's that. I also got my own thermometer. Now, in the future, when I'm a veterinarian, um, will I have one of these on hand? Yes. Always have one of these on hand. Will I want it to be my primary? No. Um, I'm obviously right now not going to be spending $400 on a quality A-grade veterinary thermometer like you would have like in a clinic that you hold and you stick it in and you just lube it and then you stick it in the booty. Um, but this is going to work good enough. I didn't buy any lube. I'm not going to use lube for, I no, let me rephrase that. I will use lube for the patients, but like I'm not going to buy my own personal lube, okay? I'm going to just use whatever they got wherever we are because I would assume that they're going to provide that. It's all about the comfort of the patient and almost last but definitely not least on my list are these um pen lights i got these on amazon so i think they're already like powered on they're so cute so it comes in a pair of two one of them is like a dull blue dull blue the other one is just this pretty like sea aqua green so it's, it has um on the sides of it it clips into your scrub it has like the colors i mean the colors the sizes of the pupil with sizes of millimeters here and you can also measure on this side so that's like super cool so you just a little click a little button on top go a little boop, boop, you know check their pupils boop, 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 boop. so yeah just don't make that noise because you might freak the animal out so i got that Oh goodness, what else did I get? I feel like this is a lot more stuff than I actually thought I had when I started like piling it on my desk. I was like, yeah. Um, oh, we got, oh, okay. Ah, just some basic rubber boots. Um, I have this for large animal anatomy lab because they will leak all over you. So I wanted them like reinforced up here. So they're a little, they're like reinforced here um and also i got big feet look at my head oh ah! but um yeah and also i think i would like to have boots for when we're doing like large animal rotations those boots were super cheap 
Um, so I don't know if they're going to make it until I get into rotations in fourth year, but it really doesn't matter. I really don't care. I'll just go buy another pair or if they need me to get like a specific pair, then I'll get that. Um, that's pretty much everything that I like physically have. I'm trying to like, I think I got everything. Um, I'm just so excited. But there were a couple things on my list that I'm going to say that are like on their way. So I have a pair of coveralls on the way. Um, I only bought one. I don't know if I if I need pairs of coveralls before I get into clinics per se because I think clinics is when you really need it. Um, I don't know. I only bought one. I can wash it. You know what I mean? Um, some scrubs, like just some scrubs to get like dirty in the lab. I just got like some cheap scrubs and I this is on my list of stuff to get but I don't necessarily like need to get it it's the mini vet guidebook I think it's just so cute looking and I just love all the material that it has in there but it's obviously not an essential for your first year of vet school because I mean you're not gonna be a doctor anytime soon so it's just really cool to have so I might still buy it I don't know yet, but that is everything I have for my vet school haul. Um, let me know what you guys think in the comments. I really appreciate y'all sticking through this video with me. If you have ideas for other videos, you can pop them down below. Um, otherwise, I'll see y'all next time.